30 years ago, Milwaukee starred alongside Charlie Sheen, Tom Berenger, Wesley Snipes, and Rene Russo in the 1989 film Major League. When Hollywood came to Bruce City, County Stadium, and thousands of Wisconsinites themselves became stars. Hello again, everybody. Harry Doyle here welcoming all you friends of the feather to another season of Indians baseball. Major League is about the Indians, but their stadium in Cleveland wasn't available that summer of 88. County Stadium was. County Stadium in that, at that time was pretty similarly uh, structured as, as Cleveland's. And they wanted Bob Eucher to be in the, in the movie. Just a bit outside. He tried the corner and missed. I mean, who knows baseball better than Bob Eucher? And who can be funny about baseball better than Bob Eucher? Nobody. Funny anything to add? Uh, no. He's not the best color man in the league for nothing, folks. All of the main baseball scenes, home and away, were shot in Milwaukee, including the climax against the hated Yankees, who had a Milwaukee feel of their own. And Horton wasting no time, he's going to the Duke. So one night around 9 o'clock, I got a telephone call from uh, David Ward. He says, well, we were doing a screen uh, play of uh, the actor that's going to play the Duke, and he ain't doing real well. And uh, I said to Pete Vukovic, you know anybody real big and ugly can throw the ball real hard? He said, try Willie Miller out of West Bend. This guy threw at his own kid in a father's son game. Former Brewer and West Bend native Willie Miller played the Duke. Tom Berenger, I got to know him pretty well. He didn't like how hard I threw the baseball, and he was definitely afraid of getting hit. And Tom, I won't hit you. The pitch! Look out! Down goes Taylor! For months, in a hot Milwaukee summer, fans filled the stands in the middle of the night. The bars, too. Come on, join in wherever you are out there. Uh, this restaurant is the bar scene from the movie. The same way that you've got the camera set up with the angle is uh, the same horseshoe bar from the movie 30 years ago. West Dallas Bar 4th Base had its role, too. Manager C.J. Papara made this comparison before Game 7 of the NLCS last year. Throughout the baseball season, every home game, it pretty much looks like that film. That is me and Rene Russo. This is where the director told me to stand right behind her and clap. Pewaukee's Steve Dindorf found a prime spot right at the end. It definitely goes down as one of the leading uh, baseball iconic movies uh, in a long time. And I think Milwaukee should be very proud because it was filmed right here. Well, a couple more things. I watched the movie on DVD last week just to make sure I didn't forget anything. One, it is still really funny. And two, turns out I have been watching it on cable the last 20 years or so. There are a lot of F words. So... Look out if you're watching with kids later on this weekend if, you, if the story just reminded you of that. There are a lot more great stories. I heard so many. Didn't have time for you all uh, to tell you all of them this morning, but I do on CBS 58 Sunday morning with Mike Stralo this weekend, so make sure you tune in this Sunday.